Hi guys, sorry that it seems like I won't shut up about the painting, but I'm determined to find a good home for this Dick Gregory painting and um, manifesting the uh, paint and materials I need to continue making more art. Thank you all for your support and have a beautiful rest of your day.
Why we gotta fight? Our footsteps louder than our whispers. Let's bring it to the light. There's another way.
I was just wondering if anybody out there knew that I made all the music you hear playing in the background as well. I did all the art that you see everywhere all over the place, including on my own black ass. I created it all. So um, I'm just trying to share with you guys what I am obsessed with doing and find people who can benefit from the things that I am obsessed with doing. Or find people who know how to sell the things that I am obsessed with doing. I'm obsessed with creating and I'm obsessed with talking about ideas rather than talking about people. The reason why I spend so much time The reason I spend so much time to myself is because I don't like talking about people. I don't like talking, store, telling stories about some shit that happened. This person said that and that person did this and this person did the other. Who gives a fuck, man? Like none of that shit matters. What ideas do you have for us figuring out how we move forward? as a people from now on, rather than having all of these oppressed people in the world, you know? So I, I have to stay to myself because people are not having the kinds of conversations that I wanna have. I don't wanna talk about people. And if that's all your small, tiny little brain knows how to entertain is a conversation about another person, what they did or what they got going on, then that means that your your brain is already consumed and taken over. And that means you don't have the capacity to create from zero to something. And that means you're always going to be dependent of your own enemy. Your own enemy is going to be the one controlling you and you're going to depend on your own enemy. If you do not figure out how to stop talking about people. Stop talking. To, yeah, I yeah, Max, but you talk about people all the time. Like every time I get on the phone with you and I'm trying to talk about ideas, concepts, what moves we're going to make. I always end up getting off the phone with you because you want to talk about people. So. It's to that degree to where like I don't want to talk talk tell keep telling stories and and ab about people we know. I because there's no benefit in that. We need to be talking about what moves are being made. That's it. This is what I'm doing currently right now to better my situation. That's what we need to be talking about. That's it. We don't need to be mentioning other people's names and other events and things that have happened and shit like that's already happened. And unless us getting bread right now today is has something to do with using a blueprint that somebody from our past has given us, then we, um, you know, then we, we keep it, uh, we keep it 100 and we keep it a uh, progression and forward momentum. Mm. Not the homie this and the homie that and the homie this and the homie that. You know, but anyway. Uh, I'm over here trying to uh, settle my little nerves right now. I just went on a little bike ride. Now I got to calm down. Okay then. I guess you're telling me that um that I'm lying on you then. Uh but that I yeah, I know what my experiences are and I know the people's names that come out of your mouth and I know what your conversation ends up going into when I talk to you. Um because 
I've pulled out of the conversation many times because of the direction that the conversation goes. But if you don't feel like that's the case, that's cool. We, I got plenty of homies that I agree to disagree with, and that is not a problem at all. I, um, I just call it exactly how I see it because I'm like super observant and fucking to the point and real about a lot of things. Um, and even, even my own self. I'm like to the point and real, even about my own situation and my own approaches to life. Um, but that's probably why I don't have a whole lot of motherfuckers like trying to kick it with me because I don't pat people on the back for doing dumb shit. I, I, you know, just like I don't want nobody patting me on the back for doing dumb shit. Um, that's how we build each other up and get up out of uh, and get up out of poverty. And get up out of uh, being dependent of our very enemy. And when I say shit like being dependent of my enemy. I mean. Like the government is my enemy for instance. And if I'm. If, if, if I am a dependent of the government. Then that means I'm a dependent of my enemy. Pretty much. Right. Um, so. Striving for real freedom is like striving for like. Figuring out how not to be dependent of something that oppresses us and that keeps us not only in a mental state that keeps us from succeeding but it also keeps us in an emotional state that keeps us from succeeding too i noticed um so i'm definitely cognitive of what's going on with the actual psychology of humans especially nowadays in reference to the new gadgets, the media, the social media, all of the things that are being made available to to everybody. And um, talk smack about them. Who's talking smack about somebody? All I said was I, I, that I love you, but you, that your conversation ends up talking about people too much. And you told me that it doesn't. And then I told you, well, I, I, I know for sure that I've, you my homie and we talk. And when I get off the phone with you, when I say I got to go, I can fucking bet you like a hundred bucks that it was probably because you was talking about some shit that I couldn't continue to talk about. Nigga, we, <laughs> like, uh, that's, I mean, nobody, I'm not talking, talking shit. I'm speaking my reality. I'm speaking what I experience. I'm gonna turn this damn music on, man, and um, and uh, wait patiently for the conversation that I need. That's what I'm gonna do.
Dog one comes with that shit's like eating a locust. Oh, he's eating bugs, sliding these on sleazy rugs. I see things the way other people can't see them. I see phlegm coming from the back of my throat. I see them coming with the rope. Can't choke me. I'm running away. I'm too free. It's like a kunta can tell me. Uh, yeah, y'all don't understand the frequency that I be on. Word is born for the one. <laughs> the dragon tree gets it on.